Yes, sir. You ready for this weekend, man? It's about to be one for the books for sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. Big dog here is getting married next week. It's about to have time. Oh, oh, yeah. You know it, man. When I first met this girl, everything faded to the back. All I saw was she and I, and it's just been amazing, man. She sounds perfect. She does, for sure. I'm glad you found me a good one because I know it's hard out here. It is. <laughs> it is. Trust me. It's hard, you know, but you know I'm looking forward to the good uh, as well as the bad. I'm I'm, I'm re really looking forward to it next month. Yeah, man. Stay, yeah, man. stay positive, bro. I think you should just take a step at a time. You know what I mean? I as long as you pay attention to the warning lights, you'll be good, bro, man. You deserve this, bro. Warning lights? What you, what you mean? You know something that I don't know or something? Uh, no, I just mean like with warning lights, it's just like in the car. They got like collision sensors. They got lane assist. You know, these things that just help you avoid danger. You know what I mean? Oh, okay, okay. okay. I know for me, like in my past relationships, I could have did a better job at looking at the signs. So if you look and just pay attention to those signs, bro, I know it's it's gonna be really good for you. You know what I mean? You're gonna avoid a lot of arguments and a lot of attitude for sure. That actually makes a lot of sense. What do you think I should do to make sure that we like, you know, stay together forever though? Like I said, bro, I think it's just taking it a step at a time. You know what I mean? The person that you marry is not gonna be the same person five, 10, 15 yeah. years from now, you know what I mean? Neither are you. So I think it's just giving yourself room to grow. Just like when we in this car. There's going to be different seasons where you want to pick up a different hobby, biking, skiing, whatever it is. And there's room to do all those things in different seasons. So with our relationship, we just got to be cognizant of just giving both of us room to grow. You don't want to force nothing. You know what I mean? All right, Mr. Relationship Guru, <laughs> what else can we do? Man, I don't know, man. I think, I think above everything, though, if I could say there's one thing I wish it, I would have done better in all my relationships, it's just providing our partners safety. You know what I mean? Like, since we own an analogy of cars, it's just like, we got quality seatbelts, we got airbags. Yeah. It's just all these features that, that make us feel safe. And what are we doing if we're not providing our partners that? You know what I mean? I'm not saying I'm an expert or nothing. Right. I'm just saying, if she feels safe, that's gonna give us room to get through a lot of different, uh, you know, problems in life, especially since we're talking about longevity. Well, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make her feel safe. Yeah, right. that's what I'm gonna do. So which one of y'all next? Who's next? I mean, it sounds like relationship <laughs> gurus right now. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. I'm, I'm still looking, man. We stand positive, man. One step at a time. Absolutely.